वेलकम बैक टू जॉन्स म्यूजिक वी आर बैक अगेन विद अ रिव्यू ऑफ अनदर गिटार दैट वी हैव फाउंड वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग टू शोकेस टू यू गाइस दिस व्हाट वी हैव हियर इज द लैग ट्रैवल के ए ई सो विदाउट एनी फर्दर डिले लेट्स गेट राइट एट इट इन केस यू आर नॉट अवेयर अबाउट द ब्रांड कॉल्ड लैग This is a French brand and has been in India since a while. We have previously reviewed a guitar called T88 and there's also another model called T70 which are really good guitars in their price range. Now why this guitar is in today's video is because of the size. We really love travel size guitars because today's musician is a traveling musician and also they are looking at longer hours of practice and playing so a small and comfortable size is an absolute blessing of a guitar to have so there is a myth that smaller size guitars are for kids that is absolutely not true in fact smaller size guitars are even made by bigger brands like taylor the famous one is gs mini this almost is of the similar shape even the brand martin has dreadnought junior lx1e these are all small size guitars made especially for professional musicians so there will be a difference when you are looking for a smaller size but that will be not in a compromising of tone that will be in a compromise of a bass sound because dreadnought size guitars were meant to have heavy bass and these won't really deliver that other than that a good tonality is something that even the smaller size guitars will deliver and this particular lag model is absolutely a very interesting sound uh, that we have found so coming to the specification this is an all khaya guitar now khaya if you are not aware of what is the wood it is african mahogany mahogany is something that is being used across a lot of guitars so it is not a new wood to be honest khaya is the alternate of mahogany that is african mahogany so we have a solid khaya top and laminate khaya back and side you can see there is a nice bowl back design over here this is not really a defect also there are some people assuming that this is a defect no this is a bowl back design for smaller size guitars that compensate the strength of the guitar as well as a projecting sound now this guitar is also great to travel and perform because it's loaded with an electronics this particular pickup is called micro lag we have the bass treble volume and an inbuilt tuner there is no battery pack here because the battery is right here and the output will be from your strap nut at the bottom we have a strap nut here as well we have a khaya neck as well so more or less this guitar is entirely khaya um we die cast tuning keys a really good looking keys there is nice embossing over here the key is very unique in shape and particularly i am a very big fan of the headstock of lag because none of the other guitars have done a detailing of having a step uh, over here and with the logo very pronounced so the shape of the headstock is very unique uh, if you compare it to other brands also this guitar has a very beautiful uh, design across the sound hole that star really adds to the element of the guitar so look wise this guitar is absolutely lovely the sound is good as well we are getting into the sound review very soon speaking about the fretboard and the bridge the company has mentioned something called as branco wood now i have to be honest i haven't found much references about branco wood in the past i am assuming this is processed wood because there isn't really uh, much research available even on google regarding branco wood in fact this is the only guitar that is mentioning this wood uh, look stable doesn't have any finishing errors it's in fact to uh, pristine to be honest uh, and the frets also very well polished no rough edges or whatsoever it is done very well another lovely thing is this black border that the company has added gives the guitar a nice uh, outline i can say and also this top beautifully merges into the side and the back so there is no binding here it is a very nice shape doesn't hurt your uh, arms or whatsoever uh the finishing wise i can give this guitar a 10 out of 10 there is zero errors that we have found that can be noteworthy now that is not the interesting part this guitar comes with an absolute beast of a bag this is a bag that we haven't really found in any other guitar models the one of the guitars that we have reviewed in the past is the cot core oc that came with 
a good quality bag a travel size bag with such good quality i haven't really found starting with the back it's got very heavy padded straps this almost feels like a 25 mm and it is airy as well so that you wouldn't sweat here we have paddings on the back so this is a very thoughtful design done by lag a uh, really good cushion padding this to supports your upper back and this supports your lower back very thoughtful because the guitarist wears this bag uh, when traveling and this is good to pass some air so that the bag doesn't get really get sweaty so 10 points again to lag for the design coming to the front and the sides we have a very rigid plastic side handle which is usually found in hard cases it is not really found in soft cases we have a front handle to hold here we have a bag pocket over here which is very uh, hidden per se uh, here we have a cable that comes with the guitar we have an allen key that comes into the guitar these are the longer allen keys that means the truss rod starts at the 14th fret that is again a very good feature for your guitar because it doesn't affect the body in the long run uh, we have this nice tag that says pushed to the next level i don't know what that really means uh, this is a serial number with the registration card so that's also a great thing and this is the factory control certificate that means this has been tested hand written so that means it's definitely tested so what we have here is pockets for two pens small diary and even you can keep some stuff over here a really nice pocket and coming to the bottom pocket now this is again one detailing that i like it's embroidered it's not print it's embroidered so feels premium in every matter this pocket is large enough you can see it like this large enough to hold uh cables some pedals maybe uh, books and any other things that you're traveling with now this was the outer side of the guitar inner side is even something better this is better than my pillow that i am currently using so if you're stuck at somewhere and you really want a pillow to sleep you have this right here absolutely good quality neck rest that sticks on to your guitar bag and the strap to hold this entire thing is velvety so you won't have any kind of scratches on your guitar at all we have a string protecting patch over here so that the sharp edges of the string doesn't really tear the back even the bag has got nice spiky rubber so that your bag is not damaged from the bottom with my keeping like this overall a very heavy padding i can't really even press this this is has probably has a plastic sheet inside so this is like a semi hard case that you can travel with just considering the bag itself this bag should be easily about 5 to 6000 rupees minimum so that is some coming free with the guitar and that is an absolutely great thing that lag is doing so that are the specifications of the lag travel kae you saw the accessories you saw the bag now it's time to check out how this guitar sounds
I forgot to mention about the nut and saddle. They are of very good quality as well. Not cheap plastic and would not wear out. Also, the bridge pins are black. Looks very nice. It doesn't look of cheap quality materials. So overall, the look of the guitar is very balanced with the head stock, and nothing is out of place, is what I can say. And the sound hole work entirely puts the guitars into 10 out of 10 in look perspective. Sound is again subjective. If you're looking for a travel size guitar that you want to have as a backup guitar, that's something you want to travel with. This is even amazing for junior players who are serious learners. This guitar falls into all that category. There is another very important negative part that I have to mention that this guitar doesn't come with a 9 volt battery or your standard size battery. This guitar loads with the tuner battery. If you've seen that is that model number is called CR2032. That the problem with this is that this doesn't have a very long life like your Duracell uh, 9 volt batteries. Also, this might be little difficult to procure in most areas. It's of course available on online platforms, but uh, if you are in urgent need of some batteries, your local stores may not have this battery. So this is something that you have to purchase and keep in excess uh, instead of running out of batteries. The reason uh, they have used such a small format pickup is probably the size of the guitar should justify the pickup. Any large pickup will look ugly on this guitar, so that is the reason they have named this micro lag and a smaller format. The other guitars, the Lag T88 and the T70, they come with standard size pickup with a 9 volt battery. So I believe this is because of the design and overall look. The pickup output doesn't really have a difference. This is just a disadvantage in terms of procuring the battery. So that was just one negative aspect that we could point out. All other aspects uh, seems very promising for this guitar. We really like to showcase guitars that stand out from the other guitars, that they are doing things differently. And of course, when you're buying some premium guitar, it needs to have something that it's offering different from the other brands. So an all Kaya or an all mahogany with solid top option is very rare in the market in this particular price range. For more detailed specifications, the link is right in the description. Please do click that and the whole specifications, photos, all are there on our website. You can log into johnsmusic.in and browse for more guitars if you're not looking for this particular size as well. So that was a review of the Lag Travel KAE guitar. This guitar is readily available to be purchased on our website. If you have any further doubts or queries, you can reach us out on our call or WhatsApp support. We are here to help you out to make the right decision regarding your guitar purchase. We are taking an incredible amount of time to make these videos for you guys. So it will be highly appreciated if you consider our website for making your purchase. So thank you again. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more product reviews and educational content. See you next week with some more stuff. Until then, bye-bye.